What's up, YouTube? It's Tiana the Boss, and if you want to know how you can have your own sound like this, keep watching the video. All right, so the tools that you're gonna need are scissors, an exacto knife, some paper, and like something that you could trace, like a projector if you don't have a projector your tv and some eva foam roll next you're gonna like we're gonna make this sign so you're gonna take a picture of your logo and if you don't have a projector screen get you some paper right screen cast to your tv and then you're gonna trace it like outline it It should look like this. Now, yeah, it doesn't matter about the imperfections. We're gonna fix that. After you cut out the outline, you're gonna put it on a piece of the foam board. You see, I had to hold it down with some canned goods because uh, it was rolling up. You're just gonna trace it with a ballpoint pen and cut it out like that. So it's EVA, and this is 24 inches, 60 by 70 millimeters. Then this is what it looked like. It's this thick. It should look like this, and then we're gonna cut it. Okay, boom. So after you cut like the excess off. What we're gonna do is we're gonna take an exo knife and the same exo knife and then we're gonna like trace it out. All right, after 40 days and 40 nights in a tad bit of carpal tunnel, I finally got this out. Now it's time for the letters. Take our Dollar Tree craft knife and we're gonna cut the letters out. Cause we're gonna use this part like as an outline. So this is what it looks like. Okay, so next I went to the Dollar Tree and got a foam board. It's like a poster board. And I'm tracing this to make it sturdy. And then I made it smaller because I'm just going to hot glue it to the back of the sign. It's going to go like this. Now you see it's not bending anymore. Okay. Before you spray paint it, get you some Mod Podge and coat the um, letters and the, the base of the sign with Mod Podge because if you just spray paint over it, it's going to absorb the paint and it will look, it will look good, but it's not going to look like that, that finish that we need, but you mod podge it and then we're going to spray paint it and then it's going to like give that glossy finish. I'm going to use candy paint for the base and then I'm going to use the coral paint for the leather. All right, so after your spray paint dries on the phone, you're gonna like take your stencil, you're gonna place it on top of the base, and then you're gonna just take the letters and then place them right here inside, but you're gonna glue it down. After you glue it down, you're just gonna press and hold it so that like the glue can like get tackish. And this is the end result. This is what it looks like. Um, I wanted to add my own personal touches and like have the white right there, like to outline the edges. I am very much pleased with this project. And uh, yeah. All right, and that's the end of the tutorial. Um, stay tuned for the next video where I'm going to be showing you how to DIY your own tabletop canopy. Don't forget to like, follow, and share this video. I'm out.